Uh, yeah, um, it's quite a, a you know a funny one regarding I stepped away quite young. Um, long story short, um, I got quite lucky quite young. Um, Same for was I was 20 years old. Uh, picked up around about 40 uh, games in about 18 months. Uh, you know, went you know I was quite lucky. Went really well, um, and then re-signed. And just before I re-signed, rushed my bicep. Um, Long story short, it was three operations in 12 months continuous. So I had, had a whole 12 months out. Um, came back um, and then opportunities were quite limited there. So uh, I was lucky enough to get an offer for the Scarlets uh, from back home. Um, so moved back, you know, quite ambitious, but it just didn't really seem to work out. And it just got to a stage where Funny it's, funny, it's like looking back now, I was only 25 at the time, but I was so frustrated not playing and I just got to the stage where I don't really want to be a squad player. Like what you can find is, especially front row, you can kind of live off one or two good seasons for 10, 15 years of your career. But for me, it just really wasn't, you know, my, um, you know, my, my style. So I just thought I was going to put the Scarlets, um, set away. My agent went to me, right, we got you a club. And I just went, hang on, I just actually want to... Uh, I just want to um, take a step out from rugby. I did it since I was 16, and did that. Then moved back up to London. Did so many different jobs, from like painting, decorating, from selling veg boxes and tube stops and everything. It was quite random. And then Sonny texts me. So Sonny Parker, who was the DOI when he first came here, so I played with him at Ospreys uh, with Kai texting and go and join and do the SNC stuff. Um, first response was, no way, mate. I could not think of anything worse than being involved in rugby. Um, and then he, looked, he said, look, I have a few weeks. Think about it. I'd love to get you on board. Um, and then spoke to my old man. He said, look, think about it. You know, Welsh, you know, it doesn't matter what situation they're in. They're a massive prestigious club. So probably the first time I listened to my old man, and I went, right, stuff it, let's go for it. And um, I start my third season now, like really, really, really enjoying it. And funny enough, I'm, you know, I've, I've set up a gym, my own business in Old Deer Park, London Welsh, um, and it's, you know, it's been probably the best move I've ever made, in, you know, in my career. And I'm, you know, lucky enough now I've got a full-time gym, I've uh, got people working for me. Um, so yeah, like it's it's worked out for the best.